Alrighty. Back to it. I, I actually did not have to do much grinding to do the other thing. So, anyways, last time we entered Xdeath's castle, found out it was, you know, a biomass. And uh, we were heading to the top, but first, there is a particular blue magic I want to learn. Ah! Okay, I'm gonna have to revive her. Yes! We now control the red dragon. Now, if this works like the, uh... This should work. If it still behaves like it did. Okay, there's level 3 flare. Yep! Got it! Alright. Notice that damage. <laughs> so now I can actually just defend. And let's go ahead and bring you back. Because you can just use Blaze. Or we can't. Right, okay, you're... Up Blaze would have been... would have still worked, but I guess not. What I can do is just summon... Okay, he actually probably is resistant to petrify. Uh. Oh, thank god, I can just do this. Turn down for what? And he did. There we go, level 3 flare. Very useful, very dangerous. If you can't control Red Dragon, then... There's, like, one other way to get it. And getting it that way is really not advised. Alright, let's put you back in Summoner. What did I have you on? Ooh, I could put Dual Cast. Dual Cast on a Summoner. That is... Hefty. Put on Gold Hairpin. And... Keep you as a thief. Let's take you off Beastmaster now that you know control. Um, um. Who should I. Who should you be? Is there anybody I haven't displayed? I haven't done Dancer at all. Have I done any Dancering? I honestly don't remember. It's been too long. Screw it. Dancer! Not rapid fire. Give you summon. Summon dancer. There we go. Ribbon. And then let's give you. Wait, really? Wow. Could have magic defense. So this is the part in the game where magic defense becomes a little more important, but also the ribbon just has really good defense anyway, so. Perfectly fine to do that. But yeah, summon dancer, thief, ninja. And let's just go ahead and tint on that. And then continue on with the. With the meat castle. Oh. I don't know why it, it went all the way up to slot one. That's really weird. Okay! Oh my god! I forgot Thief runs so fast. Oops. No, he's undead. Don't do that. So... Dual cast with summon is hilarious.
Also, dual cast with summon is great for being able to set up your support summons like Golem. Thanks for the heal. This floor in particular is kind of a dangerous floor because of uh, the random encounters with dragons. So far it's only giving me red dragons. Alright, let's go ahead and put Golem. Dancing, even though that might be a bad idea. So now that we have Golem, we have an HP wall. So any physical attacks Red Dragon does is just going to be stopped by that. No, not Mystery Waltz, Lena. Stop it! That's all your MP. Oh, that's Krill dead. So yeah, Red Dragon is undead, so... Things like Mystery Waltz or Jitterbug or anything that would drain HP gets reversed. Which also means you could technically drop, like, healing items on it and do damage. And white magic. I don't think Phoenix Down would work though, because I'm pretty sure Red Dragon's heavy. Let's get out of here before shit. Oh, okay, this is a normal one. Oh yeah, I just realized, if Lynn is in the back row, she can't really do much damage, because then it needs to be. Even though her HP is bad. I really need to give him some... You don't know time magic, that's bad. You know time magic. That might be more important coming up here. Off of summon. Not working, not so good. Uh, ah. Uh, what would I give? I'm sure I want to go dual wheel. Let's go ahead and give you rapid fire. Might not be particularly good with a knife, but also Ei Nuki. I was trying to use it during the mini grind. What's annoying is that Ei Nuki makes you wait way too long to trigger for how generally ineffective it is. So I've decided not to really use it because, like in the original version. He would trigger it pretty quick. Or, I guess, rather in the GBA version, I've never used uh, EI New Game. Original, original, original PlayStation. Okay, let's take Learn off of you. Actually, let's swap you to a better job. Well, not a better job, but a job where you have more defense. Synergy. I don't really have any. Don't wear the Hypno Crown. I think that's the only heavy helmet I have. So yeah, her HP right now just like skyrockets from that little 
boost there. You have the great sword equipped, which is fine. Again, knives are bugged, so agility doesn't actually factor that much into their damage. The only benefit using a knife would be, would be, blah, blah. the only benefit to using a knife would be having an enemy's evade, which I'm not sure I really need. But I already have knife Lena here. Let's get back into physical hitting, and then just have Ferris be our uh, support mage. Oh, and look! Summon orb. Hmm. I wonder who that could be. And of course, more lava. What that means... Loading! Okay. This is weird. So... <laughs> three blue dragons is very, very dangerous. Uh, in the original GBA version, at least, the three blue dragons are actually stacked on top of each other. Which led to a very strange situation of not realizing there's multiple blue dragons. And so it's very easy to die from these dudes, because they have an attack called Ice Storm that does a lot of damage, and is ice, obviously. So, generally you wouldn't want to fight these guys. Generally. They might actually be weak to fire, so maybe I can do some Spellblade shenanigans here. Also, we have rapid fire, so... Okay, it's called frost now. Oh no, frost is not what I'm talking about. Alright, so flame rings are causing that, uh... Okay, that didn't really do much extra damage, so I guess not. Okay, that won't work because they're flying. Let's see if they can be gravity. Nope. Or I guess it just missed, so. Alright, so let's just switch to uh, Break Blade here. Wow, they really wanted Lena dead. Shit. And there's Ice Storm. Frost, yeah, Frost being like a weaker Ice Storm. And, yep, there we go. Go ahead and see if we can maybe dance you back to health. Or sword dance! That works. Boom. Yep. Break blade. Very, very much a good insta-kill attack. And yep, they do drop a lot of experience, so if you have an easy way to take care of them, it's a good idea to fight them, but otherwise you just want to run away, because they are a huge hassle. And of course, we have a switch puzzle. Want to go up. Ah! And then you just fall down here if you get the wrong button. Oh, Iron Fist. Ooh, ooh. God, I, I should have healed her. I should have healed her once we got out of there. Too late for that now.
Really, I shouldn't have done that. They really hate you! And Bart's just killed himself, hooray. And dead. So that in particular is why it's a little risky to use Break Blade here is Black Warlock can confuse, and if they confuse your Mystic Knight, yeah, your Mystic Knight will start turning everyone to stone and you'll just insta-game over. <laughs> Anyways, let's go over here because the stairs are here. It leads to 8,000 gil. Not worth it. Not at all worth it. If you don't have Geomancer or access to float. And let's just not fight this fight. Alright, let's try this again. And I went one step too far there. It's weird that the Iron Fists take more damage from fire, but less damage from earth. It's really weird. You're dead. Gonna die? Yeah, you're dead too. Woo! Oh god, there goes a plane over here. Hopefully it doesn't pick up. Okay. This one. And this one. Yes, there we go. And we teleport... Here! Just go ahead and do some... Healing here... Yeah, I'll leave you on time, Matt. Alright. Oh boy. We must prove ourselves. To da ah! So for anyone who's familiar with Carbuncle, yes. He looks hideous here. Go ahead and that. Don't think I can silence him, but I might as well give it a try. Can't confuse him. Okay. But basically, Carbuncle, he already has Reflect Up. He has really high defenses. And the most most of what he'll do is he'll toss magic off of himself at you. And he will occasionally do physical attacks. Really, I should have done this first. The golem. And that missed because he's a new asylum. It. I mean, that works. Now, there's something in particular I'm waiting for, because after a while, 
Carbuncle will actually... His Reflect will drop. Which also means... Oh, God. Which also means his defenses will revert, and he will also stop being heavy. So if I don't murder him before then, and he actually switches, we'll get to see that. And I'll have to redo the break plate. Thanks, asshole. Ha, <laughs> get owned. Oh, see? Yep, he just tried to cure himself. Now, let's use Katoble Pass. Victory. Just a fun little gimmicky boss where you just have to wait until he's vulnerable or just damage race him. Now we can summon Krabunkle. And that is why I did not stop to grind Reflect Rings, because... For those who do not know, Carbuncle... Where is he? He's supposed to become an item that you... I thought so. Oh, no, there he is. Okay. This time they actually just put him straight in the inventory. Straight in the bell list. So for those who don't know, Carbuncle puts Reflect on the whole party. So if you have a summoner... That is where... You just say, I don't need a Reflect Ring. Like, unless you really don't want to keep putting Reflect on your characters, which I don't know why you would be like that. There's no reason to grind Reflect Rings if you can summon. Now then, I take want to throw. Alright, now the chest over here, I think... Ah! Long haul. Just run. Run. Just run. Just run. 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 The fights are getting tedious. Maybe it's this one? It's that one. Okay. Another Twin Lance! Just in case you didn't get the one, or didn't get any from stealing. Which at this point, getting a Twin Lance now is kind of... Eh? Because at this point you would have better weapons. Oh god, was it the left one or the right one? Or... This left one, okay. Okay, that one leads to progress. Don't step on that button again, because then the bridge will go away. Here we are. We'll get rid of our float, but that's okay. All right. So for the upcoming bit, let's put you back on Thief. No, that's not Thief. That's not Thief. That's Thief. Hmm. 
did I give you? Huh. That's just... Whoops. I accidentally hit remove all. Put on your thieves glove. We need you... The ability to take... Why do I still have leather armor? What the heck? Okie doke. So, moving on. Well, wake up. Something I need to check right now. realize I should probably fight a few more of these dudes until I get another power staff. Or that's it. Never mind. <laughs> that's uh Yeah, now I have poo two poo. I have poo. I have poo tower staves. Now you don't break these to make something go berserk, you just attack it normally and it'll go berserk. And specifically, there are two bosses that are very useful for doing that for. Here first, because... Uh, out of here. Oh. Did not want to fight you. Partisan, which is a very good uh, lance. And Fuma Shuriken, which is the most powerful throne item. This does a shit ton of damage. I am not dealing with this. Okay, fine. You wanna dance? Let's dance. Oh, you cheater. Okay, so... They're not supposed to be able to do that just out of hand. Like that. Like out of turn, I guess. Is a better way to put it. Because... The triggering of that is supposed to be if they all die at once, they shouldn't be able to arise anything because nothing's dead yet, because they all died at the same time. But because this game has screwed that up and made them die individually, that makes these fights way more arduous than they need to be. Just by virtue of screwing up the, the way that goes, script-wise. So those rabbits are way more a hassle than they need to be. Okay, there's nothing in there. Well, let's just go on and, uh, whoa! Ah, Gilgamesh again! Yep, so he stole what was in that chest. He stole from a treasure chest in his boss's castle. Which makes no damn sense, but whatever. Shit. So 
can't steal. I need to double check this right quick, sorry. Okay, that should have been a Genji helm. That doesn't make sense. What the hell? Okay, we're gonna see if maybe it'll change in a little bit, but yeah. Fire double twin lances is just ridiculous. If I should throw anything at him or if I should just keep going like I am. I guess I'll just go ahead and haste up. Oh! Nope. Oh, that killed him. Whoops! Stop having her level, jeez. Everybody wants to kill Lena and do shit. What the hell? And here we go. Alright. That's all the damage we really needed to do. So now the rest of the fight will just play out as usual. And he'll do a few more things, like talking silly. Uh, yeah, Galif kind of is not here anymore, Gil. Yeah. Well, it's really awkward in here now. Oof. Alright, let's see if maybe it'll steal. So apparently Excalibur was in that chest. There we go, Genji Helm, got it. Uh, Gil doesn't look like Excalibur is doing a lot of damage here. <laughs> well. Oops. into the void. No! And we got Excalibur. Yep. So the Excalibur in that chest was a fake. Legendary Holy Sword. Or is it? So it has very high attack power, but the scripting drops your actual damage down by like 99% or so. You only do like a tiny amount of damage. There are only two ways of bypassing this. Throwing the sword, which of course uses it up, 
and uh, goblin punching with it. And here's the Genji Helm. Stops confusion in many. So if we wanted to equip that on a knight, that would be basically the best helmet in the game. Now bearing in mind, ribbon covers most status ailments that the Genji equipment will block. The exceptions are like aging, zombify, and instant death, which can be covered by things like angel ring and bone mail. So, anyways... Okay, I know I put you in Dancer, but I want you to be doing something. So... Let's actually make you... Oh, because you have Rapid Fire. That is especially going to be handy. Yeah. I want you on the Aegis Shield, though. To, do I want you to have flame ring? No, I want your defense to be. Uh, you stay as a thief, sure. You stay as ninja, because I want you to learn how to ninja other classes. Hmm. Yeah, you keep white magic. It can be support. Yeah, that seems like a pretty good uh, setup there. Let's just go ahead and drop a tent. Double check the time here. Yeah, it's only 37 minutes. Going. Alrighty. I really don't want to fight these. As per usual, if you're running away from a fight, you might as well put in commands to at least, like, yeah. Just so you're not sitting there constantly waiting. So, funny thing about the GBA version, as much as I say this version of 5 has scripting issues, GBA version also has issues, but to a lesser degree. Chests like this, that have like a special trigger to them, will reset visually, but they don't have like a second version- they don't have like a second copy of the item to grab. It just resets, it's closed, and then you open it and it's like, oh wait, it's empty. Whoops. Soul Potion. Shit. Of course I have to get a call in the middle of recording. Do not interfere. Best. <laughs> just FF5 in a nutshell is we're here to stop you, but why? Don't even know what I'm doing. You're just coming over here. Junk calls, as usual. Yes, I will not tolerate any more interrup interruptions either. Let's go. Enough with these stupid... Pointless phone calls. Let's go. Next death fight. He will lead off with, like, one of three... 
one of three attacks, which is Doom. There's like Doom, uh, a couple of other instant kill kind of things. You can also start off with level three flare, which is the other way you learn level three flare. And I stole an elixir off of him. So something I said uh, like a video or two back is that you can use a Staff of Light to break it over X-Death's head in order to deal holy damage. And he takes double damage from holy, but it's not worth grinding for a Staff of Light if you have other methods of doing this, which I do. And of course half the party have flame rings, so that's all cool. Let's go ahead and toss Carbuncle on here. Now, an important thing to note is that I have Lena with Drain Sword and Rapid Fire, which means she will not die. Like, even if she is the last surviving member of the party, Rapid Fire Drain Blade can just keep her alive permanently. So long as you just keep swinging, but she'll just get all her health back. Oh, whoops. Forgot about the reflect. Oh no! Oh no! Oh my god, that was... Oh my god. That was possibly the worst thing to happen! Oh Jesus. <laughs> On top of healing him for 9999 damage. And there we go. Now note that he's also a multiple of three, so level three flare would be able to do insane amounts of damage to him as well. Especially if you reflect it off your own party. If that's possible. I don't remember if that's actually possible. Okay. First off... It's okay, so long as so long as Lena keeps rapid firing her drain blade, we have won. It'll just take time. I can't heal. You know what? I forgot. I didn't want white magic on Frill. I wanted blue magic. Because White Wind cannot be reflected. It can heal through Reflect. That is the ideal way of healing when you have Reflect up, is White Wind. And someone with high HP, like a chemist or something or other. But, I cannot do that. Okay, you did the reverse blade. Yep. You just keep drain blading even though it's half damage. Okay, that's not actually worth it. May have to do something about that. You know what? Let me show off the Fuma Shuriken. Look at that damage. And he just did Earth Shaker, great. Did I already do Golem? Probably not. Everyone's just kind of falling apart and dying here because I keep screwing it up. Get in the front row. How did you take no damage from that? Bro! Okay, fine. I need a haste. That's what I should have done first was Hestego, but... Oh well. This isn't Fiesta, so I'm not in danger, really. Hmm. Of course I could! I guess let me show this off right quick. Start the fight over and do this fresh. 
And that's why you equip Aegis Shield. She just blocked Doom. Now we start with the Rapid Fire. Put on the Drain Blade. So, Vacuum Wave, which is the attack used before, is just a really, really powerful... Um, non-element, or it's a really powerful physical attack. Which is a little weird. Because you'd think it's a spell, but it can be blocked by a uh, golem, so might as well drop golem here. So yeah, Lenolin will just stick to the rapid fire. What I can do also is just start putting defensive stuff on people. Drop Titans. So X-Death here is also one of the reasons where if you don't have Carbuncle, you would want a Reflect Ring. Because once you do enough damage to him, he goes into Berserk mode where he does two attacks at once. And part of doing those two attacks at once is dropping a Vacuum Wave and a high-level spell, which can be reflected right back at him. But right now, I'm just going to stick with doing damage. And wait for Reflect until later, because I'm going to try to put Shell and stuff on everybody for the spells that will still hit. Because something like Earthshaker will bypass Reflect. Give you that shell. Let's give you Shell, just in case, just in case Krill dies. don't need to see the animation every time. Oh, there's Vacuum Wave. There's Firaga. And now let's put on the Uncle. reflect, but the blue flashing isn't happening. Damn it! That is not the person I expected to die. I should have spent an elixir on... Well, now Bart's is unprotected completely, so he's probably gonna get nuked. Minute here. On cue, right there. Oh wait, he got healed. Oh, ah, flame ring. Yes, haha. You fool! You've fallen for my trap. <laughs> I forgot about the flame ring. Let's go ahead and drop an elixir on Krill, just to make sure she doesn't die. And, uh, her can't do anything with this, right? Okay, so let's just bonk. Alright, Golem. We need Golem back. Oh, fuck ass. <laughs> there we go. 
Hey! What the? That's two dispels in a row, you dick. You cheater. Ugh. That is such that is such low fucking odds of that actually happening. But it doesn't matter, he's dead. Dunzors! There he goes. Got jack shit for beating him. No, the crystals are shattering. Once again, we were too late, as per usual. The castle has chomped the crystals to bits. Now suddenly the castle's gone. Wait, this music sounds familiar. Castle Tycoon? We're back? Yeah! It's Castle Tycoon. Apparently, World 1 Castle Tycoon is right near X Death's castle in X World 2. Map wise. Anyways. Uh, let's go ahead and save on that. And I will pause recording.